2011, UVA Wise opened its doors to the David J. Pryor Convocation Center. Now in its 13th year, it has turned into a sporting event spectacle, all thanks to one man leading the day-to-day -day operation on top of his work at the mic, stemming from a love for the college and all of Southwest Virginia. Welcome to the Pryor Center here at UVA Wise. You all may recognize the voice, one that echoes through the Pryor Center as soon as you walk in. I'm Chris Davis. Uh, I've been the director of the David J. Pryor Convocation Center. When the doors opened to the building, we were known as the multi-purpose facility here at UVA Wise. And, uh, and then the uh, unfortunate death of, of then Chancellor uh, David Pryor. Within three months uh, after his passing, they dedicated the name uh, of the building to him. It was then a dedication in Mr. Pryor's honor that Davis put on his shoulders to create a home for the athletic culture in the area. It's just become the most electrifying place for uh, a high school game to play. I hear people all the time say, I think Dr. Pryor would be happy. And knowing what his vision was, it really has turned into that. Hey, I need somebody to run upstairs. And for a guy that wore many hats in his life, from campus recreation to refereeing, it was an opportunity Davis couldn't pass up, ultimately opening the door to his gift of being on the mic. Using the glass on Saturday with the bank Before open. high schools ever played, they were kind of like, we got to have somebody to be the PA guy. And I said, well, I, you know, I'm, I can do it. I never thought that this would be, this would be my seat on game days. Are we set and ready for everything tonight? Yeah. Since right. then, it's been Everybody Davis leading a small team of just three full-time employees and dedicated student workers to create an epic atmosphere, night in and night out. Let's make sure we're ready to go when we open the doors at 6.30. Sound good? I kind of get amped up on what am I going to say when that first three-point basket's hit. Kelly Miller hit that one from Thorns Creek! That's what I want to do here at the building is anybody that steps in those doors, when they leave, they had a great time, uh, and they want to come back. Davis soaking up each moment with his love for Southwest Virginia shining through. Proud of what we've been able to do since the doors opened. Years ago, I took a picture, lights were completely out, and this chair was the only one that was pulled out. And I made a Facebook post back then, and I said, I just wonder how long I'll have the opportunity to, to sit at that chair and, and do what I do. So I just have a love for the job and a love for Southwest Virginia, and, and I think that's what drives me.